Today I'm going to show you guys a house library script. This one has the chance of a pet spawning with a weapon, which can all be changed to your liking. It also utilizes PSUI for the hacks, depending on the tier or type of house being robbed. I'll leave a link to the resource and creator in the description. I hope you enjoy the video. First, click the link in the description that takes you to the resource, and once we're here, we're going to hit the green code and download zip. Once it's done, open it up. We're going to open our server resources. And then drag this in. Then we're going to rename it and remove the main from the end. Then we're going to go to our server CFG and ensure the resource. Then hit file and save. Next we're going to go back to the resource. Go into the images folder and copy these. Then go to whatever inventory you use. I use QB inventory, so we'll go there. Go to HTML and images. We're going to paste what we copied. Then you can close out of that. After you've added the images, we're going to go back to the README and copy the items we need to add. Then go back to your resources. Go to the QB folder, QB core shared and open the items then we'll scroll down i'm just going to put them here clean that up a bit and then we're going to hit file and save next we're going to go back to the resource and look at some of the options in the config We'll leave this alone and start with the minimum police needed for the house robbery. I'm changing it to zero for testing, adjust it as you wish. Next is the minimum and maximum time for the robberies, which is when they start and stop based on the time in the game. That's followed by the ped that spawns. I'll attach what it looks like by default. I also left the link in the description to the site for ped models. So I'll go there and pick a ped to replace it with, for example. Okay, then we have the chance of the pet spawning and the chance they'll have a weapon. I'm setting them both to 100 for testing. Again, adjust as you wish. You can then choose which weapons they will have. I'm going to change the second one to the pump shotgun. The last option for this section is showing what options you need when you're at a door and letting the player know the house can be robbed. I'm going to leave that as true. The next section has rewards you'll find in each area of the home separated by tier. There are six tiers in total with mansions being tier six, so you can go through and change the items accordingly. Then there are the searchable items for the tiers. We aren't touching that. Then you have the cores for the home. And lastly, when players are wearing gloves or not. If you have custom clothing, you may need to add numbers for when they aren't wearing gloves. And if you change anything, be sure to hit file and save. Then you can start your server and test it out. Okay, so I'm back in the server. I'll show one house out of every tier. I will mention by default the alerts are through PS Dispatch, and if your job is set to police, the ped will not spawn. So we'll go ahead and try to trigger the alert. There it is there.
Okay, so I'm at a tier 5 house, and as you can see, the house hacking laptop is required, so one of the items we added earlier. Go ahead and use it and start the hack. Okay. Jesus, he was ready. And then it's the same searching we've been doing. Again, depending on the tier, the items you find will be different and they look different inside. So I'll move on and do the last tier, tier six. Okay, so we're at the tier six house. We'll use the other laptop. Okay. And then again, we have the same searching. That'll be all for this video. If this helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you need help or have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching. Uh -huh.